glad to entertain any particular questions, applications, online, offline, and uh, be uh, hanging around for a little bit. So uh, um, appreciate your time. And, and uh, again, 45 minutes is, isn't a lot to cover a lot, but I wanted to cover some important things that uh, as a manufacturer, uh, generically, and uh, talk about some technology issues, some installation issues, um, some, uh, some safety issues. And uh, so hopefully the information's been, um, just one or two things have been, uh, been helpful. Any questions at all that you, anybody would like to ask or have me go over or hang around afterwards and take off on? Is that packware software, is that through the HMI? That's that's through the, uh, through your DCS? Or is that no, it's right? actually just separate. It's PC loaded only. Okay, so um, you go out to the instrument itself. Exactly, and it's not ne networkable like a lot of other hard devices are. Um, it is an uh, individual device um, in the loop, for sure. And so just PC-based. Your, your, your transmitters themselves don't have a memory where they're going to remember a process of said unit? Does it mean yeah, they do. They, uh, they memorize uh, any fault. There's a complete history uh, from the moment that the unit's been powered up, um, and it's uh, time-stamped. Um, and uh, so uh, it would carry that uh, if it went into fault uh, and went back out of fault, that history remains. Is the fact where the only way to get that information out of it? No, it's in the front display also. It's, it's, in, the, it's in the advanced features where you can just scroll down in through the menu and be able to pick that up from the front display or hard handheld device or also the PC. 